Hey, so guess what I haven't done in a while? If you watched my weekly vlog, you'll have seen that I did a massive shop in Primark and I came out with three full massive bags. So I am just gonna get straight into this so that it doesn't take all day. Cause anybody got time to listen to me talk about clothes all day long, let's face it. As always, I'm gonna start with what I'm wearing. I always wear something out of my Primark haul and I am loving this top. It is, I don't know what the material is. It's obviously green, it's just normal length. The sleeves are long, but I've rolled them up just because I don't really like having long sleeves. I kind of get on my nerves. I always roll my sleeves up. But this was £10, which I thought was really, really good value. It's got sort of like a crepey texture. That's the only way I can describe it, but it's just bright green and it's obviously gorgeous. The next thing that I have to show you is this beautiful coat. How gorgeous is this? It was £25 and oh my god, they had it in pink as well and I really couldn't decide which one I wanted but I went for the lilac in the end because I tried the pink on and it didn't really suit me as well even though it was a gorgeous colour but um, oh my god, I just love this so so much. It's not all that warm, I will say that. It isn't very thick, but I thought maybe for when the weather isn't horrendously cold or maybe if I'm doing something that doesn't involve being outside for a really long time. That's the only thing about this is that it's not very warm, but you know what? I just couldn't leave it. It was just so gorgeous that I had to get my hands on it. Next, I got this Chanel-esque sort of blazer. This was £20 and it's, oh no, these pockets are not real. It doesn't have pockets. Um, um, I just think this is so nice and smart. Um, I think it'd be really, really, really nice just for if I want to dress up or whatever during the day. I think this is a great jacket for that and it has a zipper, which is really handy as well. I picked up a couple of jumpers while I was out and I got this one, which is like a dusky sort of pink colour. It's got snowflakes on, obviously. It was £14 and it is what they call eyelash hair or something like that. I keep on seeing that term around and that is what this was kind of branded as being. I don't know, eyelash hair, whatever that is, it's hairy. Next up I have this amazing Christmas jumper. I am excited about this. It has got elves all over it and candy canes and like snowdrops. I just think this is so, so gorgeous. And what is even more amazing about this, you've probably seen them, is that it lights up Oh, look at that, how amazing is that? I am definitely wearing this on Christmas Day. It is so tacky, but I just think it's amazing. I mean, if you can't love a bit of tackiness at Christmas time, there's just obviously something wrong in your life. Next up, I have this dress, which was 13 pounds. I love it, it's got gold zip detailing, and it has it on the back as well. It is just past knee length, and I just think it is really good for, oh my, my, Mm, my top's annoying me. I think this is really, really good for work or if you just want to be a little bit smarter. I just think it's really nice and I love baggy clothes. I really don't like tight clothes unless I'm on a night out or something because I just feel more comfy in baggy clothes. You don't have to pull your belly in and all that nonsense, but yeah, do you ever do that? I'll be, if I wear anything tight, I'll be walking around halfway through the day, I'll realise that I am not pulling my belly in and I'll just realise that I have a pot belly and that's never a good look, is it really? I hope I'm not the only person who does that. So I just kind of opt for baggy clothes in case that happens, but yeah, I love this. I think it's really smart and I think it'll go nicely with the Chanel-esque jacket as well. I actually spotted a sale rail which had things on for a pound. A pound, like how amazing is that? And so I picked up this skirt. It is looking very shiny on camera. It doesn't look as shiny in real life. It's kind of, it's pleather. It's plasticky leather, obviously it's not real leather for a pound. Um, but yeah, I just thought this would go really nice with jumpers or with a tight sort of top tucked in. It's all right if the tight top is tucked in because you know, this covers the belly area. Not that I have a big belly or anything, I just like to sort of know that if I let it all out, it's not going to be really noticeable. I also got another skirt. This is a gorgeous dog tooth pencil skirt. Um, it was eight pounds and yeah, does what it says on the tin. I like these for tucking tops in as well. They're great with crop tops because they're obviously, they come up to your waist and yeah, I just thought this was really pretty. So I seem to have gone on a skirt rampage and I got another one. It is also a pencil skirt. What do you call these? Does it say on here? It has a name. 
This pattern has a name and I've forgotten what it is, but um, if you know, let me know down below. But yeah, I really like these. I just think they're quite smart, but you can wear them in a casual sort of way as well, just with some winter boots or whatever. And this was eight pounds if I haven't already said. Trousers! So I got some black trousers, can't have enough pairs of black trousers, whether it's for work or just day to day, I love them. Um, these are just slim leg trousers, they were a pound! Oh my god, I got this on the pound rail as well, jeez! Yeah, that's good for a pound, isn't it? They've just got little pockets, oh no, they don't, they're not real pockets, they're just fake pockets, but oh well, for a pound you can't really argue, can you? And they also have little fake pockets at the back as well. Okay, now I'm going to move on to other stuff that I got in the sales section, and this I also got on the pound rail, it is just a t-shirt, um, I thought that I could wear this in Dubai or whatever, I got this actually in a size 6, and I also got it in a size... 16. I got it in a size 16 as well because I wanted to wear the bigger one to bed or just around the house or whatever because I just really liked it and I thought for a pound, I mean, come on. Also for a pound I got these dungarees, they're like shorts dungarees and I thought these would be great for in Dubai, just around the pool or whatever, the beach, that sort of thing. I'm just speeding through these a little bit because they're not really wintry but also a pound, this Run DMC t-shirt, I got this to wear in bed because I'm running low on bed tops so I thought I could buy pyjamas or I could just buy these. I like to wear baggy t-shirts in bed I must say um, but yeah I really like this. Also for a pound, I just got this really long blue vest top, um, I just got this for the beach or the pool and stuff like that, just for chilling and it's got really low armholes so yeah, um, I don't really know how to describe that but yes you can see. Next up for two pounds I just got this t-shirt and it, it has French writing on, I'm not gonna try and say it because my French accent is horrendous and I don't want to offend anybody. You can see what it says there and I just thought that I would wear this in bed again. Next up this one was a pound again and I just thought that I would wear this in Dubai with jeans or whatever just for doing my errands and that sort of thing. It says true love lasts forever. Oh how sweet. This was also a pound and it is just a really really long sort of dress t-shirt. It says New York on it and I thought this would go really well with my denim Air Force Ones. They're denim and white leather so I thought that these would go really well together and that's just for Dubai as well. Just a nice baggy cool long dress top. I got myself another long t-shirt dress. This one is just purple and as you can see oop, it's long. It's fallen off its hanger but yeah it has sort of like oh god this is not working guys, um, it's got a bit of a loose thread, that'll come off. Um, it's just got like a kind of wide v-neck and I just like this, I think with trainers or flip flops or whatever, I really really like these for holidays and in the sun and or even summertime here, you know when we have a nice day. Next up I have some bits and bobs, I'm just going to delve into my bag here, um, oh I got these really cute socks, they're like Christmassy socks. There's a pair with Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer on, there is another pair with Rudolph on, and snowmen! Cute! I love them so much. Um, these are £1.50, they're just, they're like little ankle socks, yeah, they're ankle socks, and I just thought these would go really nice under boots, you know boots that have that little cutout bit at the side, like my Fashion Union ones? I thought that these would go really nice under those. Next up I just got these two packets of cotton pads, these were a pound each and you get two um, lots in each packet and I just, I like these for taking my makeup off and stuff. Yeah I just pick these up when I'm in Primark while I'm there because um, for a pound these are actually really good value. Okay guys I'm gonna end with some staples and I just got these 200 denier tights, exciting I know but you know you need them at this time of year. These these were three pounds and how many pairs? I think, is it one pair? I don't even know. I think it's just one pair in here or is there two? I don't know. There's either one or two pairs in here. I have no idea but I just needed some new tights. And also for three pounds I just got a pair of leggings because you know you can't have too many leggings and these are apparently new improved fabric. So we'll see how that goes. I think what that probably means is that your bum won't show through your leggings because I don't tend to get Primark leggings just because they can be quite sort of thin but I thought these 
do feel better quality than um, their previous ones and I'm hoping that my bum won't show through these. To be fair though, when I'm wearing leggings, I do cover my bum up anyway. I don't wear tops that show my bum when I'm wearing leggings. I'm just not kind of about that look. Um, I know some girls like it, but yeah, I like to cover my bum up when I'm wearing leggings. I just feel a bit exposed if I don't. But yeah, three pounds can't go wrong. Maisie! Oh my God, Maisie! You're so naughty. Can you see her over there? She's being so naughty. She just keeps on rustling away and stuff. I don't even know what she's been doing. But if you've heard any rustling throughout this video, it's her. You little madam. So yes, I really hope you enjoyed this video, guys. I've been so happy to be home and be able to go to Primark. I haven't done a Primark haul in ages and a lot of you guys say that you like them. So I thought that I would do one for you, seeing as I bought three bags full. But yeah, let me know if you enjoyed this video. Give it a big thumbs up as usual if you did. And I will see you soon. Bye.